you know, one, I think you need a special owner to, to allow you to do it because there's obviously a lot of money involved too. If you're trading for, for veterans, the other concern is exactly, you know, the budgetary wise, cause you know, with, with early round picks, you know, what they are going to be against the budget is, but once you start the path, can you get off it? And if you do, is that like a, a two year total recycle, but it's interesting. They've done it, you know, 18, 19, they didn't do any trades in 2020. Obviously they've done trades this year, Stafford. And to me, it's interesting. One, they're, they're, they're figuring out the cap Two, the play. It's interesting. The players that they've traded for, you know, cooks and Tlaib and Peters and Fowler and Ramsey and Corbett and young linebacker, they gave up less than what the player was drafted. You know, Cooks, Tlaib, Peters, Fowler, Ramsey were all first round draft picks. Um, and if you could say going to Ramsey here, okay, we gave up two ones and a fourth. And he's been a top 10 quarter his whole every season and looking at it, okay, what are the odds of a red corner in round one? Well, it's 50%. And a blue corner, it's 14.7%. And it's, it's, you've got one of the better corners in the league playing for you instead of hoping, oh, I have a, t you know, I, the other adage is, hey, if we keep going to the playoffs, we're picking 22 or later.